It's vital, whether in combat or training, for soldiers to trust and respect each other. But if a soldier doesn't feel like part of the team, it can be a deadly serious issue. This is why the Army has and will continue to crack down on situations and incidents that weaken the bonds our soldiers have with each other, and in turn, weaken our Army. Interaction, one of the most basic forms of human communication. A casual touch, a look. They could be harmless, but they could also be highly offensive and can be considered sexual harassment and sexual assault. The U.S. Army and Fort Benning are taking these incidents seriously because they are detrimental to the Army's climate of trust and respect. Sexual harassment, sexual assault is a grave threat to our combat effectiveness as an Army. You know, our Army is a team, a team of teams where soldiers are bound together by mutual trust and respect. They're in units where, you know, you're, you know you, the person next to you is willing to give everything, including their own lives for you. Anything that violates that trust, that violates that respect, is a grave threat to our, our combat readiness. That combat readiness is the overall goal of the Army, so it's important that each soldier does their best to combat any feelings of discomfort caused by an inappropriate situation, because soldiers are held to a higher standard. First of all, we have to recognize, right, the standards that come with our profession are very high. And so this kind of behavior can't be, can't be tolerated at all. That has a lot to do with our culture. You know, it has a lot to do with what we expect of each other as soldiers, what is expected of us by our society and meeting those expectations. These acts of violence, cruelty, and deceit infect the Army ranks with distrust, leading soldiers to doubt their organization, their unit, and their battle buddy, which is why the Army is working so hard to eradicate these instances. We're not going to tolerate this. We're going to fix this uh, because it is inconsistent with our, with our values. It's in inconsistent with who we are as an army, who we are as soldiers, what our expectations are of ourselves and of each other. Just like you know, any other problem that we face in our army, in combat, in peacetime training, we're going to solve it with our, the chain of command. And I have tremendous confidence in our leaders at every level. Fort Benning is making a preemptive strike on sexual assault and harassment. With training, education, and a better understanding of each other, our Army will continue to be a team of teams, making sure that every soldier feels like we really are one force, one fight.